I love the teachers that never talked down to me, but held me, you know, with dignity and, and caring. And so I thought if I ever did teach, that's the, what I would want to be. When I come in and see those smiles and then getting out the paints and they're that excited to make a piece. Once they're invested in the projects that we do and the creativity behind it, learning just becomes so much easier for the student. I just see them sail. We talk about being a man or woman for others here at Creighton Prep. It's not about being self-centered, but other-centered. And what can we do out there to make our world a better place? What's it look like in the community? It's not just what you do at school, but when you leave these doors of Creighton Prep. I'm excited about my religion and what I do, you know, and how I can inspire the next generation. I want to be like one of those pillars in the community where I can help and make a difference. Once you've taught in Catholic education, you don't want to go back. The feelings you get with all the faith formation that goes on in the building and just the whole atmosphere in general. The relationships, a lot of the kids in these buildings, you know, I would claim as my own. You want them to succeed just as I want my own kids to succeed, whether it be in the classroom or athletics, extracurricular activities. And so we support each other as there is nothing quite like it. I love my job. I mean, there are very few days where I don't legitimately want to come to school. And I know there's a, not, a lot of people in the world that are fortunate enough to say that, and even a lot of teachers that probably aren't fortunate enough to say that, but just the atmosphere, the kids, and um, the support that we generally have here is just wonderful.